Hey guys, I wanted to talk about exercise today and why you may want to add some B1 to your workouts if you want to spike your energy. Now, B1, thiamine, is intimately involved in the mitochondria, the energy factor of the cell, especially in cellular respiration, which is basically using oxygen in the combustion of food to energy. There's five different enzymes that it's involved with. One is basically just breaking down food, breaking down the carbon atoms and releasing the energy as ATP, which is like the energy currency of the body, as well as enzymes to help clear out waste products from metabolism like lactate and ammonia. So that's actually very important as well. Oh, and by the way, the more carbs you consume, the more B1 you need. If you're on keto, you definitely don't need as much, but I would recommend taking some because B1 is like an anti-fatigue nutrient. It can give you endurance. So if you're going to take B1, I also recommend taking the complex. Uh, a good source would be nutritional yeast. There are other natural sources. If you take too much over a long period of time, it might create deficiencies of certain other B vitamins. So just take the whole complex and a, a nutritional yeast, maybe some additional B1 about a half hour before you work out. You should feel your energy going up and definitely have more endurance. Thanks for watching. Hey, so if you haven't done so, please press subscribe now. That way you can be aware of all the new content that I'm putting out on a regular basis.